If you've been tested for COVID-19, you know the test is invasive and it can really be painful, but there's a new way to test using saliva. Team 12's Matt Uris is joining us live this morning in the West Valley where those new tests are being used. Matt? Good morning, Trisha. This is a really cool deal. I'm out here at uh, auction. It's the site of the first saliva-based COVID-19 testing. Going to have more on that in just a moment. First, I want to reiterate the governor's message the past few days, which is if you feel like you have COVID-19 symptoms, if you've been around someone who has COVID-19, go ahead and get tested and give you a couple of ways you can make that happen in just a moment. First, back to these saliva-based testings. To help all this happen, Arizona's Department of Health Services and ASU have partnered up. The pair announced that they are providing free saliva-based COVID-19 testing for up to 100,000 Arizonans. ASU says it's the first to develop a saliva-based test. Other tests swab your nose, a brief procedure many have described as uncomfortable to say the least. If you have a question about COVID-19 testing in general, you can call 211 and to find a test site location, you can visit azhealth.gov backslash testing. I'm going to say that one more time, azhealth.gov backslash testing. Again, the times to get tested here today run from 8 or noon. As you can see around me, they're getting set up. The first people to roll through again right around 8 o'clock this morning. You do need to make an appointment, though. You need to pre-register before you head on down. You can do that in the 12 News app right now if you think it's necessary. Right now we're live. Matt Yuris today in AZ. All right, so any folks maybe holding off on getting it, knowing it was invasive, this is good news for those folks out there. Less painful, always a good thing. Thanks, Matt. You can find the latest details about the coronavirus and how it's affecting Arizona. Check out our daily coronavirus live blog on the 12 News app.